The world's first cruise liner to resume operations during the COVID pandemic arrived back in its home port of Geelong on Wednesday. Among the returning passengers was Keelong Mayor Lin Youcheng. Lin says he took the tour as an opportunity to propose further tourism cooperation schemes to the administrators of Taiwan's outlying islands. Passengers on the cruise ship wave hello as they approach the shore. It's easy to tell they've had a good time. The Explorer Dream set sail on July 26 from Geelong. It arrived back in the port on Wednesday after a four-day island hopping voyage. Passengers pick up the luggage from the conveyor belt and walk outside. Many are carrying shopping bags full of goodies or even boxes of Penghu specialties. The cruise did not leave Taiwan's waters, but it's almost as if the travelers were returning from abroad. About 1,200 passengers travel on Taiwan's first island hopping cruise. The itineraries on offer start from Geelong with stops in Penghu, Jinmen and Mazu. Returning travelers were full of praise for the trip. It was fun. It was not bad at all. I felt very relaxed throughout the trip and very happy. It felt as if we were overseas. It was fun and quite interesting. They fill up your schedule and you can pick what activities you'd like to join. Zilong's mayor was among the travelers in the cruise liner, but his travel wasn't just for pleasure. Lin took the opportunity to propose future tourism cooperation to the commissioners of Taiwan's outlying island counties. Over these past few years, I talked with the commissioners of Penghu County and Lianjiang County about making package tours with the crews and offering special perks. I think it can open a different kind of tourism model. Loading the suitcases into the car's trunk, the travelers return home all freshened up. It's a new way to tour Taiwan in the post-pandemic world.